Brian Cashman, the architect of the New York Yankees. He has done it for many, many years, put together great teams, made the playoffs almost every year, and won four World Series championships. What else can you say about Brian Cashman? But do you think Brian Cashman is overrated? Look at over his whole career with the Yankees. I think he is a little bit overrated. I'm going to show you why in this video coming up. Welcome to New York Sports Ram. My name is Jeff and I will be your guide in this video today. If you're a returning member of our channel, thanks for coming back and I appreciate your support. For all new members of our channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button down in the description so you'll be notified of future videos. Also, leave your comments, questions, anything else down in the comment section in the description. Also, you can leave them on my social media links which are also down in the description. Just a quick note, I'm going to be putting out one minute or less rants on players, New York players, New York teams, or just uh, New York sports news. YouTube calls them shorts, so be on the lookout for that. It's going to be really quick, uh, right to the point, one minute or less. So if you are not really a person who likes to go through those long videos, well, these are perfect. Right to the point, uh, maybe 50 seconds, and then you also can leave your comments down below. Same thing as, as the long videos and uh, also smash the like button and also a subscribe button if, you, if you're not subscribed to the channel. But uh, these are, I think I've never seen them before. So these might be the first uh, in this particular area of you know, sports. So these are the one minute or less sport rants. Uh, be on the lookout for them They're called shorts and uh, you'll see them uh, when I put them out. Okay, thank you. Okay, let's get right to it. Uh, it's going to be a very sensitive issue. I know there's a lot of Yankee fans in the area, New York, everywhere in the country. Um, but I uh, also want to make the disclaimer that I am a Mets fan, but I am totally being objective. I'm totally seeing what I see in front of me and the facts and what happened over the history of the Yankees. So uh, let's just get right to it. I don't want to make this uh, a history of the Yankees. So we're just going to get right down. Do you think Brian Cashman is overrated as a general manager. Yeah, Brian Cashman came over in 1998 uh, as a general manager, and he, as soon as he came on, bam, World Series, bam, another World Series. Brian Cashman came over and won his first three years, three World Series. Now, the team was already loaded, had a great uh, leader of the team in uh, Joe Torre. Yeah, they had like players like David Wells, uh, Roger Clemens, David Justice, uh, like players like Bernie Williams, Derek Jeter, Jorge Posada, Mariano Rivera. How can we get him? Mariano Rivera, one of the greatest ever relief pitchers in the history of baseball. You know, all these like, like just good gritty players, Scott Brocious, Chuck Knobloch, like all these players. I mean, just it went on and on and on for the three years. So, you know, Cashman was like, oh my, this, <laughs> three World Series, <laughs> first three years. The, the guy is amazing. The best general manager ever in the history of baseball. And then, uh, mm, uh, yeah, since the 2000 uh, World Series championship over the Mets, uh, yes, I got to say that, uh, the New York Mets lost to the Yankees in 2000. But uh, let's forget about that. Um, anyway, so from there till present, one World Series, 2009 World Series, and that's it. So we're talking, we're talking, what, uh, like 21 years right now? One World Series, 21, 21 years, one World Series, 21 years, one World Series. I know they made it to the playoffs like mostly every year. I know the, the team, the, the payroll was sky high getting luxury taxes, going past the point, uh, just crazy, crazy. But they made the playoffs, great team every year, just a solid team. Okay, he, that's every year, okay, we got that. Great team, great uh, roster, like 14, 15, 15 appearances in the playoffs uh, since 2000. Uh, they were in the World Series twice. Uh, they lost to the Arizona Diamondbacks and, and the Marlins. And they also won the one in 2009. Um, but I mean, one championship for the Yankees, uh, the status of the Yankees, the roster of the Yankees, the money of the Yankees, 
one World Series out of 21 years we're, we're looking at. That is, that's, that's, that's crazy. And I don't know what to say. Like, is it just bad luck? Uh, what do you think? I don't know. Uh, I just think that the Cashman got put in a great situation, obviously. First of all, Cashman is like, this builds a team. I think that he builds a team to win, obviously, in the, in the regular season to get to the playoffs. And that's it. He don't build a team to win the World Series. He just doesn't. It's obvious. Well, it shows. The team is, like, the team every year is right-handed. Like, totally right-handed. There's no left-hand hitters. Totally right-handed. Always gets big boppers to hit home runs in, in Yankee Stadium. Always likes that kind of player. Great job with the relief pitching. He loves release pitching. Like, just adds and adds and adds and adds relief pitching. Let's, let's go back. Three things. All right-handed team. Always. Always. You just you will not get left-handers. Second, always goes for the big boppers, home run hitters. Never for the contact hitters. He just does not want, the, he does not, not get the contact hitters. The, the gritty players. The ones that, you know, that are going to, you know, hit the ball. Uh, slap the ball to right field. Slap the ball to left field. Slap the ball to center. Slap it. Uh, do whatever they have to do to get on base. That's the kind of players the Yankees are missing. And that's the kind of players that Cashman just refused to get. And I'm sure, yeah, I'm saying this is all, you, you can go back and go, oh, what about that player? Oh, he got this player. Yeah, yes. In, in uh, recent years, he started getting uh, more contact hitters, but mostly it would take him the whole 21 years. He, he just just forgot about them. He likes the, the big names, big boppers, home run hitters. And forget about the 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 players that go in there, gritty players. They're gonna get the hit. They're gonna get the ball on the bat. They're gonna not strike out. Uh, another another thing, he gets players striked out all the time. The big boppers, the, the home run hitters, striking out all the time. A big strikeout uh, team. Uh, that's another that's another uh, problem with the Yankees. So we got that. We got the. We got the right-hander, we got the, the home run hitters, not the contact hitters. And he every year forgets about the pitching. He could care less about starting pitching. I don't know what is wrong with Cashman. He just, he just doesn't care about starting pitching. Let's load up the relief pitchers, forget about the starting pitching. Who cares? We can win without starting pitching. Uh, no, you can't. It, it's been proven 21 years. One championship. If you're liking the content of the video, smash that like button. Also, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, hit that subscribe button down in the description so you'll be notified of future videos. Like, the, like the team now, like uh, uh, Judge, Big Bopper, Giancarlo, Giancarlo Stanton, another Big Bopper, uh, home run, a home run or nothing. Gary Sanchez, just another home run guy. Like, just home run, home run, home run, home run. That's all they look for over there. Like, uh, I, I understand, you know, Yankee Stadium, you know, short porch, home run hitters have, uh, you know, just go crazy over there. And you, you do need home runs. You do need home runs. Uh, home runs are good for the team. You have to supplement the home run hitters with the gritty players, with the contact hitters. Now, he does make the, the good, I mean, the good, like I said, I gave the, the players before, but uh, uh, there's, there's plenty of players, you know, I'm not doing the history here, but, uh, but recently, Urshela, uh, another just great trade from the Blue Jays. Uh, pick them up. He play awesome for the Yankees. Just <laughs> a great pickup, a great trade. And Brian Cashman, all the credit. Aaron Hicks, got him in 2016 from Minnesota. Aaron Hicks, another great uh, player Cashman picked up. Another player, Luke Boyd from the Cardinals. <laughs> just out of nowhere, like, all of a sudden, just a great pickup. He, he was great for the Yankees. The most consistent hitter. Home runs, his hitting. Uh, getting on base, just everything. Another great pick. This, this guy, I'm not telling you, Cashman is a smart guy. Cashman is uh, has done his has has his good trades, has good acquisitions. I'm not I'm not I, I'm I'm not telling you he isn't. I really am not. Another one, DJ Lemayhu from Colorado. <laughs> My goodness, just like an all-star player for nothing. Another Cashman uh, trade. <laughs> wow. I mean. I'm not, I'm not telling, I, through the years, he had his bad trades, bad acquisitions, and had some good trades, good acquisitions. I, I understand that, and recently he's been on fire with getting players uh, off the scrap heap, 
uh, players that really that no one knew about, or and all of a sudden they're like all stars. I mean, he's he's a smart guy. He knows what he's doing. He's a lifer. Yeah, he's grown up the whole time in baseball. He knows a lot, a lot of information. Uh, I'm telling you, I'm not, and I, I respect him. He put together the Yankee teams after Yankee teams after Yankee teams. Great uh, regular seasons, going to the playoffs most years, going to the World Series. Frank Hatcher's been in uh, one four World Series since his tenure, and now he has been in six World Series, uh, but uh, uh, been in the playoffs most of the years. Uh, I understand that. <laughs> I understand that. I'm just saying, what do you think? Do, do you think that uh, is it good that since 2000 to 21, he's won one uh, World Series? That's it. Made the playoffs a lot of times, but I mean, is that good? Is that good enough? Is that good enough for you, Yankee fans? I mean, I don't know. Let me tell me. I don't know. I, that's, that's a long time. Uh, that's a long time for, for the Yankees, for the roster, for their. Uh, organization for their the money they put in there and everything uh, I don't know what do you think and also one last thing before I go uh, I, he made a terrible decision Girardi he Brian Cashman made the mistake of Joe Girardi the manager of the Yankees uh, he was a player for the Yankees 1996 won World Series with them as a catcher really good solid player solid catcher uh, became the uh, the manager after uh, Joe Torre and really was a great manager, just a gritty, uh, you know, hands-on uh, manager. Uh, just really knew everything about baseball. Really, the baseball knowledge is uh, off the chart. Uh, really gritty, getting it in there, and knowing what, knowing what, who, to, who to put in, uh, knowing how to, uh, you know, treat the players and you know, give them respect when they need it. If they did something wrong or they weren't playing to, up to the level. He was going to tell them, uh, really, I just a really good manager, uh, won the World Series in 2009. Uh, and he's just really great for a long time. And then uh, Brian Cashman uh, fired him or released him, whatever you have to say, and got I put him, I put Aaron Boone in his place. I just, I just don't see it. Uh, and there's no reason why uh, he, he made it to the playoffs and all we, almost made it to the World Series again that year. And then got fired. I mean, just God, uh, they need a change. What? That's, that, that's just a bad decision by uh, Brian Cashman. I just, I just don't see it. I, I still don't see that. I, I, I don't agree with it. And I, it's just a, I, I think that he was a really good for the Yankees, uh, and he would have been really good after if they kept on. Kept them on. I think he might even won a World Series, but uh, they got Aaron Boone, and, and the story is from and, and it goes from there. And the story is what it is right now. So uh, that's one other thing just to put out there. But uh, I'm just telling you, this is not a hit piece for you know against Brian Cashman. I I'm putting all the accolades over for him. Uh, really great uh, general manager. Really knows his stuff. Uh, put together Yankee team after Yankee team of great Yankee team rosters. Uh, acquired great people. Uh, you know, uh, picked up people out of nowhere, trash heap. Uh, you know, just, you know, he's always, always thinking, always a good retooling the, the Yankees uh, on the run, uh, uh, training all those players and getting back uh, all the uh, uh, these other players, younger players, uh, getting rid of the old players. He is really smart. He's, he's very intelligent. He's, a, he's an outstanding uh, general manager. As you can see, uh, he's been around for a long time, so he's doing something right. Uh, but I'm just, I'm just giving you. There's also some negatives there. There's also some things that you know. Uh, what do you think? Uh, uh, do you think that he is a little bit overrated? Uh, he hasn't really shown much lately. Uh, but just, I'm just putting it out there. What do you think? Uh, come on, Yankee fans, don't kill me. I'm not hating. I'm just putting it out there. What do you think? Do you like Brian Cashman? Do you think he did a great job? Uh, do you think that uh, he's been done a great job lately? Uh, do you think that over that span of 2000 to present that he only won one championship, uh, one World Series, is that good enough for you guys? Uh, what do you think? Put it down in my put it down in the comments. Just let it rip down there. Tell me what you think. Uh, am I wrong? Am I crazy? Am I a Yankee hater? Am I just Put a uh, hit piece out on uh, Brian Cashman for no reason. No, I'm, I'm giving you the, the pros and cons. 
And what do you think? Add it all up. Do you think he's overrated? That's what I'm telling. That's what I'm asking. Uh, leave it down in the comments. What do you think? And do you think that uh, he's going to continue as uh, the general manager for years to come? What do you think about that? Put it down in the comments. As always, thank you for all your support. Thank you for coming to the channel. And uh, I'm going to put you out. And also put out there that uh, God bless all North folks. God bless all military. Keep them safe and bring them back to their families. Thank you again for everything that you have done for this channel, for your support, for coming back, leaving your comments. Don't forget to hit that like button and that subscribe button if you haven't subscribed yet. And I will see you next video.